guys welcome back to my channel if you're new here my name is candace and today we are doing a speed cleaning motivation video so i'll be honest with you full disclosure i was not motivated to clean before starting filming for you guys i just wasn't i wanted to lay in bed i was feeling lazy but i really wanted to get my house in order for the weekend so i figured what do i do in order to get myself motivated and for me it's okay start in one area that if you get that, if you just do that one area, you're fine. Your house looks better and you feel better. And to me, that's the kitchen. So I started in the kitchen today. And as I was cleaning the kitchen, I got more motivated to continue on and clean the living room, the laundry room, and get a ton of vacuuming done because I really wanted to get my house tidy for the weekend. So you are seeing this on a Friday. If you are needing to get your house reset for the weekend to get ready to enjoy your family time where you really don't want to spend a lot of time cleaning and vacuuming, then let's get it done together. So right now I'm in the kitchen. I'm cleaned off this island. I'm wiping down my counters. There's some dishes that need to be put into the dishwasher, some that need to be washed by hand. I have a few loads of laundry that need to get done. So if you are needing this motivation today, hit that thumbs up, make sure you're subscribed and let's get this house put back together. Okay, so now I am just loading up the dishwasher. There was a ton of dishes in the sink. Normally I would hand wash, but there was a little too much for my comfort zone. So I went ahead and loaded what was in the sink. I'm gonna start the dishwasher and then hand wash the ones that could not go in the dishwasher. I think there was two pans and then two little water bottles that I'm just gonna go ahead and hand wash, dry and put them away. And then after that, we will continue to wipe down the counters and head into vacuuming and then into the laundry room and the living room. Far away from the city lights So small under the night sky It's just us two but I don't mind You could never wear me out Even after all of these years you still look at me with the same love It's just us two but I don't mind You could never wear me out
Okay, so we are rinsing out the sink. I just wanted to clean the sink really good and then head on over to the dining room table. As you can see, there wasn't exactly a cluttery mess, but it definitely, the house just felt grungy and just not as shiny as I usually like it. So I'm definitely feeling good now. I'm feeling motivated, continuing to clean up the house and getting it ready for the weekend. I know that I'm gonna feel so much better once I get these few rooms tackled versus just staying in bed doing nothing all day. So if you need that little boost of energy, a little boost of motivation, just start in one spot. See how you feel after you finish it. If you feel motivated to keep going, then definitely keep going. But as you can see, you guys, I did cut off my hair. Look how short it is. <laughs> I had to, there was, it was, I had so many split ends. It was just so damaged. So sometimes you got to do that. You got to just cut off your dead ends. And that's not only talking about your hair, toxic relationships, things that slow you down, that don't motivate you, that don't energize you, all of the things. So that's just, I think that was a Pinterest quote. It was like, cut off your your dead ends and I'm not just talking about your hair but I'm I totally agree with it so right now I'm vacuuming I'm going to get the kitchen vacuumed up and then head into the living room the living room was a little bit more messier than the kitchen I guess you could say we just had a ton of trash we eat snacks while we're watching tv at night and then our trash just kind of lingers around so I definitely wanted to get it tidied up Keep on telling lies That is how we stay alive mm. So you know that I don't mind About what is wrong and what is right We keep moving in different rhythms Still I know what you feel I just wanted to pick up some of the trash that was on the floor, some of the shoes and laundry that gets left in here from time to time. And then these blankets I just folded because we're gonna end up using them again. So normally I would put them in the linen closet, but I'm just gonna leave them out for now. I'm wiping down all the surfaces with Mrs. Meyer's all-purpose cleaner, and then I'm going to be running the vacuum. So I'm finishing up the vacuuming in the living room and then I'm going to empty out the vacuum because it was actually quite full so I wanted to go ahead and empty some of it out into the trash and I realized that the trash was full as well so I'm going to take the trash out 
into uh, where the trash cans are outside and then also put a new trash bag in the trash can. As you can see, they're kind of too big for our trash cans. We ran out of the regular 13 gallon sizes. So these are a little larger, but I'm just making it work. I tie the side to where it's a little tighter so it doesn't come all unraveled and stuff at the top. But after this, we are going to go into the living room, into the laundry room, not the living room, the laundry room, and start a load of laundry and fold a load that was in the washing machine. So if you're needing to get some laundry done, go ahead and grab that laundry basket, get those clothes, and let's do them together. Stepped into my life, such a magic feeling. We tore down my walls. I wish I could go back to right before you told me I'd try to change it all. But look at us now, we could have gone so far. It hurts to realize we're parted. Yeah, look at us now, this is who we are. And I just know things will never be the same We're like strangers again, again, again Strangers again, again, again We're like strangers again, again, again I just know things will never be the same We're like strangers again Tried much harder, you only have our scars. You said we'd get so high, higher up than heaven. You said we'd reach the stars. But look at us now, we could have gone so far. It hurts to realize we're parted. And yeah, look at us now, this is who we are. And I just know things will never. Strangers again, again, again I just know things will never be the same Like strangers again Make sure you guys hit that thumbs up if you are getting a ton of motivation from today's cleaning video so far. We are just going to vacuum up this laundry room. This laundry room, it's very hard to tell from the camera, but it does definitely get a ton of dirt because it comes in from the garage. So anytime my husband comes home from work or is going in and out to the barn, a ton of dirt and dust definitely kind of gravitates more to this room. So it definitely needed a lot of vacuuming and then wiping down the counters just because some of that dust can just kind of sit up there. And then I'm going to vacuum this long hallway. <laughs> this is, my kids are actually scared of this hallway. It's so funny because at night when it's dark, you can just hear them like running because it's so long. I'm like, why are y'all running? They're like, it's scary. I'm like, turn on the light. <laughs> but anyways, it definitely needs to be vacuumed. There was some dust bunnies kind of floating around toward the end of the hallway. So I wanted to go ahead and get them vacuumed up. Um, and then we are going to head into the foyer to do some vacuuming as well. So if you need some vacuuming motivation, here it is for sure. Get your vacuum. Let's do it together. That you had to I'll try to forget you Just didn't think we'd end up this way Okay, you guys, this is where we are going to wrap up today's cleaning motivation video. It was short, sweet, and to the point. I hope you got a little motivation to boost your mood and to get your task done for the day to get your weekend started so you can enjoy it with your family and not have to worry about a ton of cleaning. Thank you so much for being here, and I'll see you guys on the next one.